Welcome back to Defense Tech World. Today, we're diving into one of the most iconic creations of modern air-to-ground warfare, the AGM-65 Maverick missile. These high-precision machines are not just weapons, they're masterpieces of technology, engineering, and strategy combined into a single, powerful system. So, let's explore what makes missiles, and especially the Maverick, so fascinating. Direct hit what makes a missile tick. A missile is more than just a rocket, it's an intelligent weapon designed to strike its target with pinpoint accuracy and incredible speed. Every missile is built around three main components, the propulsion system, the guidance and control system, and the warhead. Gear propulsion, powering the flight. First comes propulsion. This is the muscle that drives the missile toward its target. Most air-to-surface missiles like the AGM-65 use a solid-fuel rocket motor, which provides instant thrust and reliable acceleration. Once launched, the Maverick can reach speeds of up to Mach 1.2, allowing it to cover several kilometers in mere seconds. Whether fired from a fighter jet, an attack aircraft, or even a helicopter, the Maverick's propulsion ensures it reaches its target before the enemy has time to react. Brain Guidance and Control the smart core. Next is guidance and control, the brain of the missile. This is where the Maverick truly stands out. It uses a precision electro-optical or infrared seeker to lock onto targets such as tanks, bunkers, or fortified positions. Some variants even employ laser guidance for pinpoint accuracy. The onboard computer processes data in real time, adjusting flight fins and trajectory to ensure it stays locked on, even if the target moves or environmental conditions change. The result? Exceptional accuracy with minimal collateral damage. Then comes the warhead, the business end of the missile. Depending on the mission, the AGM-65 can carry different types of warheads. Shape charge heat warheads for penetrating armored vehicles. Blast fragmentation warheads for softer or area targets. And even penetrator variants designed to destroy hardened structures like bunkers or bridges. Once the guidance system confirms impact, the warhead detonates with devastating precision, neutralizing the target almost instantly. Shield design and deployment. The AGM-65 Maverick was developed by Hughes Aircraft, now Raytheon, in the late 1960s and first entered service in 1972. It quickly became one of the most successful air-to-surface missiles ever produced. Over 7,000 have been used in combat, from the Vietnam War to the Gulf conflicts, proving its reliability and adaptability. Its modular design allows easy upgrades, new seekers, improved warheads, and digital avionics, keeping it effective even after five decades in service. Gear safety and storage. Missiles like the Maverick are stored and maintained under strict safety conditions. Specialized cruise monitor temperature, electronic locks, and fuel stability around the clock. Whether mounted under a jet's wing or stored in a hardened facility, every step is controlled to prevent accidents and ensure instant readiness when duty calls. Rocket legacy and the future. From the legendary Maverick to modern precision weapons like the Brimstone, Hellfire, and next-generation smart munitions, missile technology continues to evolve. Engineers are now developing systems that can think, adapt, and strike faster than ever, integrating AI, hypersonic propulsion, and network targeting systems. But one thing remains constant, with great power comes great responsibility. These technologies are designed to protect and deter, not to destroy indiscriminately. Ensuring that innovation serves peace and defense, that's the real challenge of modern warfare. Clapperboard, outro, Defense Tech World. Thanks for watching Defense Tech World. If you enjoyed this deep dive into the AGM-65 Maverick and the science behind precision missiles, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more high-tech military insights every week. Until next time, stay curious, stay informed, and stay tuned to Defense Tech World.